What's up YouTube? It's your boy Tim coming back at you with another YouTube video. And you might be wondering, why is your boy at a park? But I had to get this beautiful sunset right behind me to do a special review of the J Balvin Air Jordan 3 Medellin Sunset. So this is J Balvin's third Air Jordan. First he did a multicolor Air Jordan 1, then he did a light up Air Jordan 2, and now his most anticipated version, the Air Jordan 3 Medellin Sunset. So let's go over some of the details of the box. As you can see, there's a lot of details on this box, specifically right here we have the J Balvin logo with the lightning bolts for the eyes. We also have as the whole background basically the city of Medellin. It has buildings and all of that through this translucent top layer. Now that we pulled off that top layer, we have a quote from Jay Balvin right here and it says, a sunset always reminds me a new day full of opportunity is coming. And we have the Jay Balvin signature and his logo as well. And then one detail on the box that you might notice is that it has an ombre. It's going from purple to orange, pinkish to yellow right here. And that's basically a whole theme of the shoe. So we're gonna unbox the sneaker right here. We have more of that tissue paper right here at the top and then just the same quote about the sunset. Gonna unveil this sneaker right here. Got some tissue paper. Oh God, here we go and bam, we have the Air Jordan 3 Medellin Sunset. some of the details on this sneaker. The uppers is primarily leather and it's an off-white cream leather. We do have hits of a rough suede going throughout the back portion right here and right here on the lace eyelets as well. And for the midsole, it's basically a two-part midsole. It's mainly cream colorway, but we also have the ombre that represents the Medellin sunset going from purple to red to orange to yellow. And for the outsole, we have a clear semi-translucent outsole. Back here on both heel tabs, there's a little bit of difference between the two. One has the J Balvin logo and the other has the Nike Air logo. Both translucent with the Medellin Sunset Ombre going throughout. And another added detail is on the insoles, we have more of the Ombre fade going throughout. And at the bottom, we have the Jumpman with the Air logo as well. And for the sock lining, it is more of that cream colorway. And then just like all traditional Air Jordan 3, we have the Elephant wrapping around the toe cap and the back portion of the shoe. And to wrap up for the colors on the shoe, we have hits of this golden yellow going throughout the lace eyelets, the Jumpman, as well as this unfinished leather going throughout the whole entire shoe. They also added this hang tag of the J Balvin logo with the smiley face. One sneaker that this reminds me of is the Air Jordan 3 Amma Meunier. Both have similar leather and style qualities. And as you guys know on this channel, I give every shoe a rating from 1 to 10 based off quality of materials, wearability, and price. And for this pair in particular, I'm going to say this shoe is an 8.5 out of 10. Not one of my favorite, but definitely the best J Balvin sneaker he's ever put out. Now me personally, I'm digging the black pair that's rumored to release in 2024. But be sure to let me know in the comments down below, are you guys rocking with this one or the rumored black pair? Alright guys, well that's going to wrap up today's video. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you smash that like button. And if you are new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to check your boy out on Instagram and TikTok. Both of those links will be down in the description box below. And if you guys are looking to join up on the Discord, I highly recommend joining up on my Discord. Top link down in the description box below. Make sure you come through, show some love. Alright guys, it's been your boy Tim. I'm going to enjoy this beautiful park. We'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.